Okay, we're plugging in the, the x value to find uh, the y value on the vertex. So we have uh, 2 in place of x squared. And we have 4 times 2 and then minus 3. <clears throat> Here we have to square the 2 first and get 4. Once we do that, then we take the opposite of what we get. And then plus 4 times 2 is 8 and minus 3. These give us negative 7 plus 8 is 1. So this is a vertex 2, 1. <clears throat> now we'll graph the vertex. Go to right 2, go up 1. That's the vertex. Now again, we can use the y-intercept, which is the c. And go to negative 3, put a dot on the negative 3 on the y. Well, that was two spaces to the left of the vertex. So we go two to the right of the vertex and go down to a negative three. And we can draw a U to that. And we have the graph of it. Now we could do, you know, one point to the left of the vertex, one point to the right of the vertex in the X, Y axis. But this actually gives you a pretty good uh, idea of what the graph should be. So that's a review of what we did on Monday. Uh, start another one.